Bye. <gasps> oh my gosh, we're going in a rocket. Dude, there's a transition and cutscene. Get ready, get ready, boys and girls. Oh my gosh, we're lifting off. We are lifting off, this is insane. What? Today we're checking out a brand new game called Brick Simulator. It's so new, I think it literally released like an hour ago, and it's made by the devs that made a game called Lab Experiment, if you know what that is. Let me show you real quick. I'm gonna click on it, but it's this game right here. You may have seen it. It got big for a bit, and then it kind of died down, but it's an incredibly made game. So this dev team makes some pretty cool games. So I'm hoping that Brick Simulator doesn't let me down. If you guys are excited, then hit that like button. I was so afraid that the voice effect would have worked there, but it worked, so yay! Seriously, smash the like button, it takes like two seconds. 10,000 likes, can we do it? Can, can we do it, water bottle? Yes, we can. Water, water bottles don't talk, I'm sorry. What's going on guys, welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Russo Plays. If you're new here, hi, how are you? I hope you're having a great day. Make sure you subscribe, hit the notification bell to never miss a video. I upload two a day and they're dope, all right? We're the blue crew here, so make sure you stay a while. Whoa, I'm a little bit too zoomed in. Let's zoom out and show you guys the game. So here's the thing. I wasn't lying when I said that this is made by a really good dev team. They've made some pretty good projects in the past, but this game, I'm not gonna lie, I was a little bit confused when I first walked in. I'm not gonna prejudge it. I'm not gonna prejudge it or anything, but as you can tell, it's called Brick Simulator and it's living up to that name. I mean, it literally looks like this was made in like 2003. I mean, look at this, look at the builds. Like they just, no textures. They're just like standard Roblox studs and you know, Lego-ish, and they just look so basic, but I think that's the aesthetic they're going for, so we'll give them the benefit of the doubt. This probably gets cool, and uh, we're gonna check it out and have a good time, so if you're hyped, watch to the end because it's gonna get spicy. Check this out, ready? Equip hammer. Da! Yeah, pretty cool animations, if I do say so myself. So they got some UI on the side. Obviously, you're gonna have to collect some sort of bricks. You're gonna have to sell. Okay, chill with the bass boosted noise, dang. I guess we're gonna have to basically click to smash the brick and then get the bricks. Hi, just wanted to say hi, because those people think I'm, I'm ignoring them and I'm not, <laughs> trust me, I just can't type and talk at the same time. Anyways, you collect bricks, you sell, then it looks like there's different kinds of currencies and there's freaking brick pets. Look at those, those are pretty cute. I like them, I I'm down. All right, this seems like it could be pretty cool. So let's go over to the first brick where it's telling us to go and smash it. Oh, we're smashing it. We're smashing that brick, dude. This thing is, oh my gosh, this thing is actually really strong. Wait, owned by far, oh, he owns the brick? He took the brick? I want this brick, can I own this brick? Owned by Russo Talks, nice. So basically I own the brick now and people can't like destroy it and help me. There we go, so that's how you get the brick and you got it in your inventory. Now what you do is take it to the cell and you sell it and you make money. So that's pretty cool. It's a nice way to, uh, you know, do the simulator aspect of games, but I'm hoping that it gets bigger and better over time. You get bigger weapons, smash, bigger smashes. Oh, here's SpongeBob. Oh, there's bees, blue fish. Oh my God, I love that pet. Some of these pets are sick. There's rockets. There's a next world right here. There's like a shop right here. There's a boss battle. So there's a lot to the game. I'm hoping that it gets cooler than just, you know, smashing bricks. So let's give it a try, man. Let's give it a try. Oh, basic chest. Let's claim it. How do I claim it? Oh, that's cool. So I just smashed that brick and I got myself a basic claim che or chest claimed and I got some stuff. <gasps> Look at that pet. That thing is sick. Can I get that? I want it. I want that pet. Give it to me. I don't think they'll give me the pet. So I turned my hammer sound off because it does get kind of annoying, but I do have the sound effects for jumping and such. This is the shop right here. So in this castle-like area, this is actually pretty cool if you think about it. The builds are pretty nice. It's like a big Lego world. But this area right here is the shop and it looks like this is where you get different eggs and pets. Yep, here it is. This is where you get the pets. So I can already afford a pet. I don't know if that's my first purchase. I don't know if it's the best idea. Let's keep moving forward. By the way, as always, this game is linked in the description. It's called Brick Simulator. If you guys haven't checked it out, definitely check it out and let me know what you think. Oh, look at this Minecraft torch looking thing. So there's a bunch of different pets. Slime! I'll get you one day, slime. There's a bunch of different eggs um, and you can get like ultra rares and stuff. So at the end of this, we're gonna try and grind for these tough ones down here. Look, mythics. And there's a Robux one that gives you a mythic. Oh my, I, I might have to get that. I'm gonna wait on it for now. I wanna do some more exploring, but that does look pretty sick. 
They got some little thrones here. And then on this side, I guess these are probably portals that take you to new worlds. I'm not really sure. But right now I can't go to any of them. Uh, buy a rocket to unlock. What? Oh, look at this. You can see through it. Wait, what? What? What is this? Oh. Hidden chest. Dude, I found a hidden chest. That's really cool that they added that. So this was a hidden chest that you're, it's kind of like a secret. It's kind of easy to find, but check this out. I like that. It's like a see-through wall. You go through it and bam. So there's a hidden chest if you guys want to check that out yourself. If there's any more on this map, definitely let me know because we'll explore and find those. Dude, games adding stuff like that just enhances the game so much more. So definitely add more stuff like that. All right, let's check out the shop and see what we got. Dude, I love that little guy. Look at this, look at this shop. That's nice. Instead of just pulling up a UI, they actually have a separate screen, a little transition, and just stuff like that enhances the game. That's what I was talking about with the quality. All right, we got hammers right here. Bunch of different hammers, blue, oh, diamond hammer. It goes all the way down. There's a trident hammer. It does that many, five trillion bricks at a time, and it does 10 billion, da 10 million damage, sorry. So that's a, it's gonna be expensive. Oh, that's how much it costs. Five trillion bricks, oh my gosh. And it does 10 billion damage. All right, well, that's gonna be pretty tough. We're gonna try and grind for it, but you know, it, it might take the entire episode. What do I have enough for? Do I have enough for any of these? 300, 500, 1,000. I could buy the diamond hammer. So my first is one, this one does eight. Should I do it? I don't know if it'd be more beneficial to buy a pet first or a hammer. Uh, I'm going for it. Buying a hammer. I think it'll be a good investment. So we got ourselves a diamond blue hammer. Let's equip this bad boy and go over to some bricks. Hello, brick. I own you and I will destroy you. Oh, nice. I've been instantly destroying them. So I'm getting way more bricks way faster. Oh, that's kind of satisfying too. When the bricks like, look at that. They like follow you and go right into your character. That's sick. So the bigger the bricks are, I guess obviously the more it takes to destroy them. So you don't even want to work on bricks like this. Like normally in some games, as you farm, you get stuff in your inventory, but you don't get stuff in your inventory until you actually break the bricks. So at our level, we're just going to focus on the smaller ones because that's all we can collect right now. So let's actually get a hundred and then sell and like see how much we get. Is there like a radius of how much damage I do or do I have to click right on it? I'm not really sure. Can we break this red one? Maybe we can break this red one. Oh, the red one's not that strong. We can actually break this and I own it. So nobody can steal it from me. Nice, 84, 86, 88, and then probably one more red one. There we go. We got it full. Do you wish to sell your bricks? Yes. So we made a hundred bucks. Definitely not that much. Uh, oh, hi astronaut cell man. Smash. <laughs> also, I swear this game is brand new. If it's not, then I'm just stupid, but I thought it was new, but I'm looking at all these people and they're already really rich and have a lot of eggs. So I might've been wrong. Maybe this isn't a brand new simulator. I thought it was. Let's check the date it was made. Apparently it was created on 5-1-2020 and it was updated 7-10-2020. I think it did just come out, but again, I'm not exactly sure. So if you guys know, let me know. I, I don't know if it's brand new or not, but some people are already on the leaderboards and that kind of sucks for me. All right, let's break this brick, sell. We only have 100 bricks, so we're not making that much right now, which means we're gonna need to get some multipliers. That's where the game passes come in. All right, Russo pays here. Guys, I never recommend you guys spend as much as me. I do just wanna say though, if you do happen to buy Robux or Premium anytime soon, make sure you use code Russo, because it's the best code ever. You guys have been destroying that code and using it so much. Roblox was like, yo, Russo, there's, there's a lot of people using your code, and I was like, I know, it's kind of insane. So let's go to the shop and see what we got here. Two times diamonds. Wait, two doubles the amount of, you find in bricks and from boss fights? Oh, there's boss fights, I forgot. The door opens in 11 minutes. So I guess you go over here and this is where you fight bosses. This is sick boss battle. Every hour it spawns on top of the tower. Loot drops. So you jump on top of the tower? <gasps> Wait a second, is there, are there jumps? Oh, that's what you get the rocket for. You buy a rocket and then you fly to new islands. I didn't even know there was islands, dude. Okay, that just made this game a lot cooler. So apparently there's islands, but instead of doing the double jumps, you get a rocket. I'm assuming you don't have to jump. Maybe you control it, who knows? That'd be pretty sick. But if you don't, maybe you'll just fly up to the next island. I'm down. So let's go ahead and uh, do, wait, do I get this chest again? Nice, how many times can I collect that, dude? I got another thousand. I, can't, I just keep getting thousands, bro, I'm down. All right, now we can actually buy a pet, which is pretty cool. So let's go over and do that. But what I need is I'm gonna need to buy these multipliers, dude. I'm so down. This game seems pretty quality, pretty cool. They might update it frequently, so 
Let's support it, man. Let's get some dope stuff. I'm not gonna get pet XP yet. I don't really need that. Double speed. I'm down. I'm down to get it, Blue Crew. And uh, you have to like the video because like I'm spending all my stuff. Okay, this is this is gonna hurt the bank right here. Two times gold down. 300 inventory down. Plus two pets equipped. What's this one? Infinite storage. Oh my gosh, dude. There's so many I want to buy here. I don't know. I, I don't need these other storage ones. Auto egg buy. Double hammer speed. We need this. We absolutely need this. VIP. I got to get it. I got to get it. Dude, I'm spending. <laughs> I'm buying way too much. And then this one. Rocket color. I got to change it to blue. Absolutely. This one right here. Infinite storage. Do I dare? Should I get an infinite backpack? You know what? I feel like uh, it's hard. I'm, I'm, I'm going to save it for now. I'm not going to buy it right away. But I might just do it because we've we got so many game passes just now. We might as well buy it. We got a red cat. Nice. So this is our first pet in the game, a red cat. Let's go ahead and... Uh... Oh, wait, we have a star pet too because the, uh, the game pass. The VIP game pass. So let's equip this guy and the red cat. Nice. I like it. I like it. All right, so we got two pets equipped. The star looks amazing and the red cat. They're... I mean, they don't look that amazing, but they're unique, you know? Oh, look at how fast I am now. That's insane. All right, I just, I'm making bricks quickly. The thing that's hard is like, I, you know, like I gotta, um, oh, you can stop the collection so that you can sell and then come back real quick. That's pretty cool. Um, basically, I'm gonna need better backpacks. Let's at least try to buy a better backpack for now. I might end up just getting the, uh, the infinite, dude. I don't know, it's hard. I could buy this. No, I can't. I could buy this. No, I could buy this. 350. That's a little better, but it is, it's a tough life out here not having infinite, you know, you know what I mean? Uh, should I do it? Should I do it, guys? Screw it, I'm doing it. I'm doing it, I'm buying infinite, I don't even care. Infinite is the way to go, okay? For me, at least, because I, I just want infinite, but you guys don't have to do it like me, okay? So just don't do that. Wait, I, did it work? Did it work? Let's go to this VIP area and test this. This is where I get a special chest and uh, the pet. Oh, look, here's a VIP reward, let's claim it. 10,000 bucks, no big deal. Is there anything else over here? Ooh, there's stuff over here, what's this? Snake, bro! What is this pet? Can I get this? What the heck is this, bro? It's like a snake, just chilling. I don't, I don't know if we're supposed to be able to get that or not, Um, but yeah, I just, I'm just gonna leave it for now. So this VIP reward I can get every hour, that's pretty clutch, I'm definitely gonna do that. There's nothing else over here as I, I don't think, so, uh. It's pretty good to get VIP. All right, let's test the bricks breaking and see if we have ourselves uh, infinite right here. Ready? I think as I collect more, it'll tell me if I have infinite. Yup, there it is. Infinite collection. I don't have to worry about a backpack. That's massive. That is massive strides. So now I'm gonna make way more money. And it is pretty satisfying just smashing all the blocks, dude. I, I do kind of see what they were going with this. So our goal right now is to get insane pets, insane weapons, and travel upwards with our rocket ship. So I think the first thing, what is that flying? Is there something flying, bro? There's like a random flying pet. What is that? Dude, look at him, you see him? He's up there. That's so cool. I wonder if you can get to him. Hi, flying pet. I don't know what that guy's about, but kind of interested. All right. Let's go ahead and figure out how to buy a rocket because that's the thing we need to do to get to a new world. Also, what's this over here? Combine pets? Oh, this is where you can make shinies. So you can get a bunch of the same and make shinies and then eventually dark pets. That's actually really cool. All right, um, now let's try to buy a rocket. I don't know how to do this, but I'm not gonna lie. This game is definitely more exciting than I thought. I thought it was just gonna be this like lousy simulator with terrible builds. I'm not, I'm not trying to insult them, but like they probably know what I'm saying, but like it turned out to be really nice. And I think Oh, you buy you buy it with 50,000 coins? Dude. Blue. I need blue. Oh, the blue rocket, bro. I need to go on this. I need 50k. 50k gold. How much is that, dude? How much is that? 100k? All right, you know what? J just because I want to see what the rocket does. I'm buying it, bro. I'm buying it. I know I've just spent so much money in here, but I need to buy this thing. Bye. <gasps> oh my gosh. We're going in a rocket. Dude, there's a transition and cutscene. Get ready, get ready, boys and girls. Oh my gosh, we're lifting off. We are lifting off, this is insane. What? Dude, this is sick. This is how you get to the next area. Oh, oh, <laughs> it just dumps you out. 
Dude, that was fantastic. That was amazing. Bravo. I loved it. I loved it. I gotta say, the builds, they're not that appealing because it's like that old school, but like, I, I you know, I know, you know what they're trying to do, but like, that cutscene, that was sick. I really, really like that. Let me know what you guys think of this game in the comment section below. I think this could be a big simulator. I think a lot of people are gonna like it. Make sure you guys check it out as well. Oh my God, there's like a little ship. So this is the teleporter, I think, to go back. I'm not really sure. Um, here's a little spawn area, which is kind of weird that they have that. Basic chest in this area as well. How much does this give me? Wait, can I claim this? Nice. Okay, I got uh, 2,500, not bad. And then there's a shop up here as well. It has the same hammers, so it's not differed by the shop uh, level. So that is the highest uh, hammer you can get. Oh, look, a pile of bricks just chilling. Don't mind if I do. Nice! Now that I have a lot of cash, I definitely need to get myself a better hammer, so. Oh, and look, there's a boat over there. Oh, maybe the teleport teleports you over there? Look at all these different boats! There's just a bunch of surrounding boats, dude. This is sick. All right, let's go ahead and try to buy a new hammer right now. And I've realized that I'm already kind of far in the video, so you guys get the gist of it. You guys understand what we're doing here. Let's start the noob to pro action, all right? You've seen the gameplay. You've seen me buy stuff, <laughs> but now, when I come back, we're gonna be so OP. We're gonna have a way better hammer and be way farther in the game. I actually really like this game and I hope it continues to update. So uh, let's get it a lot of players. Like the video and keep watching. So I ended up getting a way better hammer and I got two Disco Shark Mythic Pets. They're the ones that cost Robux. Oh, I just realized your pets kind of like float around you, which is cool. And they have like a nice little trail, but look at the Disco Shark. That thing looks insane. Plus I noticed something really cool. When you come back down to the main level, your rocket ship is not here anymore. Like it's actually still up there. So in order to go back to the next area, you come over here and I think you go through like this portal right here and that brings you back there like this teleporter. And then your rocket is still like where you left it last. It's right there. So it'll be on the last island that you left it last, which is super cool and uh, just shows the continuity of this game. But check this out. So now that I have these pets, these pets have huge damage buffs and brick multipliers. And this thing is just insanely strong. Look at how much I'm getting now. I'm getting tons, bro. It's so satisfying. I had to turn the hammer noise off because it's a weird sound, but if they changed it to like a smack, I'd be down, but like, it's kind of weird, but check this out. So I'm able to destroy things so much faster. I still don't really get that much money for it, so it is kind of hard, but there's more, there's bosses in every area too, which I didn't even realize. So we got to take out some of the bosses, do a little bit more grinding, and I'll come back and show you guys how insane our lineup of pets and hammers, etc., are. Plus, you can customize your freaking rocket. I mean, how dope is that? All right, well, it's time to travel again. So, it's time to launch. Dude, this thing is so sick. I love what they do with this. It's so good. You freaking, I, I gotta show you guys one more time. Check it out. We're launching into space. It's time. We'll see you later, Blue Crew. We're going off into space. It's so good, bro. Goodbye. Okay, guys, so we made it to a really far part in the game. But unfortunately, and actually kind of fortunately, we're not gonna be able to go from straight up noob to pro in this episode like I, like I previously thought. There's a lot more to this game, which is a good thing. On every single map, there's a ton of different bricks to break. There's even like obbies to take you to bosses. This boss is currently not done, so I think they only have the first two bosses done, but there's like an obby to jump to the bosses and then you fight them and it's pretty sick. So definitely a really cool feature but I don't think I'm gonna have enough money to buy the best hammer and buy the next area. So I'm just gonna have to stop it here and get this weapon right here. This one's the Hive Hammer for 1.1 billion. Let's buy that. Hive Hammer, 1.1 billion. No big deal, just a lot of money. And uh, look at this thing, it's amazing. So I have five Disco Sharks right now. It's the max pets I can have and it's like pretty much one of the best pets in the game. Really, really good uh, maxed out level. This is what their stats are. There's probably better pets, but I don't really know. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much gonna do it for Brick Sim, guys. This game is honestly really cool. So many unique features that they added. I like the little secrets. Maybe there's more secrets around the map, who knows? But like little secrets like this, like I love. They should definitely add more, but I burped. The fact that you can have these boss battles, there's a rocket ship, you can change the color. It literally doesn't even come back to this area. You have to go through the portals and then the rockets where you last left it. Like, I love that little continuity thing. But let me know how far you guys got in the comment section below. I made it to this island and we're gonna keep going on the islands 
as time goes on and we're probably going to do the next you know another video on this so hopefully you guys enjoyed if you did smash the like button subscribe if you're new and let's just uh wait do i have enough do i have enough to get this next area i need okay yeah i need a lot that's gonna that's gonna be pretty tough all right we're gonna have to do a lot of grinding thank you so much for watching i hope you guys had a good time and i love you and uh stay blue and watch some more videos while you're at it oh and follow me on twitter and instagram at russo talks okay there's tons of you guys not following me so what are you waiting for go follow all right bye